Good Thursday afternoon, everyone. It's Eric here. Just a real quick uh, video update for you on this beautiful summer afternoon. The dew points are dropping. The temperatures are in the comfortable zone for most of us, although it's a little warm out there. And most importantly, we are sunny and we are dry this afternoon. Here's a live look in Columbiana at about a quarter after two. Just a few passing fair weather clouds out there. Temperature at 81. Look at the dew point, though, down to 61. Yesterday at the same time, dew points were in the lower 70s. There's even a, a little bit of a breeze in Columbia and throughout the rest of the valley this afternoon. Other 2 o'clock hour temperatures, 83 Lisbon and Selineville, 83 Lake Milton, 83 Newton Falls. Also in the 83 degree club, Sharon here at 2 o'clock. Now at the airport, the dew point has been steadily dropping all day. We were in the lower 70s as recently as 2, 3 o'clock this morning, but then once the sun came out, the atmosphere started getting mixed up, and with the drier air pushing in, it's been a nice downhill slide, and uh, just above my head there, over here, uh, you can see that the current dew points are in the mid-50s. Much, much more comfortable, much less hazy this afternoon. It's just a beautiful afternoon. Local dew points are generally upper 50s to around 60 here in the 2 o'clock hour. Well, weather for Weather Geeks this evening on my weather blog, ericwfmg.com. We'll examine the weekend forecast, which I think will have a couple of changes. So we might shift around our rain chances a little bit for the weekend. So I'll talk a little bit more in depth about that in, in Weather Geeks this evening. We'll take a look at next week's trends. If you're a little tired of the warm weather, I think you'll like some of next week's trends. And we'll take another uh, look at uh, what the climate models are showing for the month of August. That's this evening on Weather for Weather Geeks and on TV. Of course, I'll be on 21 News at 6 o'clock with a full update on your seven-day forecast.